I finally got my hands on a Steam Deck. Like many, I opted for the 256GB version thinking this should be okay. The top priority became installing a new SSD and finding a larger capacity drive like 1TB of the 2230 variety at a reasonable price took a while. In the end, I got a 1TB drive for about 200 bucks from eBay, the WD SN530. With the Steam Deck and SSD in hand, the upgrading part is actually really easy. If you're not afraid to install the drive yourself, you'd save over 100 bucks by just buying the base model 64GB Steam Deck and a 256GB drive separately. The last thing we need is a Steam OS installation flash drive. Valve has instructions online on how to make the recovery drive and just like fitting the SSD, it's super simple. If you don't have a spare USB flash drive, I've linked to this one in the description. It's fast and has both a USB-A and USB-C end, which makes life much easier moving from computer to Steam Deck. So with that, it's time to like the video, subscribe for more and let's get swapping. I can't say I've noticed any changes in load times or battery life, but having the extra space does mean less resource juggling and more time for gaming, and leaves me wondering whether a 64GB version should even exist. Maybe the next version of the Steam Deck should have variants going up to 1 or even 2TB. What do you think? Let me know in the comments, and come back to check out my other upgrades. Until next time.